We live in a world of two realities, the world of darkness, the world of assumptions that we make. I'll never be able to achieve that. I'll never be able to overcome that. And then there's the world of light, where everything is possible. The Or Hahayim, the light of life. This is what we mean when we light the candles and bless the light of life. How can we begin to break out of the world of darkness and into the world of light? We have the gift of Hanukkah. As we meditate and light the first candle, it is our opportunity to reach within and find that light, where we can find the strength to push ourselves to go beyond the darkness. The light within moves us beyond our negativity and transforms our attitude into one of, I can achieve that, I can overcome that. That's the power of Hanukkah. Especially on the first night, when darkness starts to begin its transformation into light, the helper candle, the shamash, opens the door to possibilities. Behold how good and how pleasant it is for people to dwell together. Behold how good and how pleasant it is for people to dwell together in harmony, in harmony. La 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 la. As we light the first candle, the Shamash candle, we say Baruch Ha'or Ba'adam, Baruch Ha'or Ba'olam, Baruch Ha'or Ba'chanuka. Blessed is the light in humanity, blessed is the light in the world, and blessed is the light in Hanukkah. Beruchim ha-ma'asim tovim la'amim bazman hazeh. And as this is the first time we light the candles, we say, Nevarechet or ha-hayim sheheheanu vegiemanu vehigianu lazman hazeh. We bless the light of life, which has enlivened us, sustained us, and brought us to this season. And on the first light we say, we bless the light of reason, the light that teaches us to see the difference between right and wrong. Nevarechet or hatvuna. And on the second night we say, we bless the light of self-esteem, the light that is, inspires us to believe in ourselves. Nevarech et or hakavod atzmi. And on the third night we say, We bless the light of courage, the light that gives us the strength to stand up for our beliefs. Nevarech et or haomet. And on the fourth night we say, We bless the light of freedom. The light that reminds us to take responsibility for our own lives. Nevarech et or hacherut. And on the fifth night we say, we bless the light of love, the light that enables us to care for those in need. Nevarech et or ha'ahava. On the sixth night we say, we bless the light of loyalty, the light that helps us to keep our promises to those who depend on us. Nevarech et or hanemanut. And on the seventh night we say, We bless the light of generosity, the light that encourages us to give even when we do not receive. Nevarech et or hanedivut. And on the eighth and final night we say, We bless the light of hope the light that leads us to a vision of a better world. Nevarech et or hatikvah. 